Because of Helene, hundreds of people in North Carolina in the mountains still missing right now, including foster families and their children. As WRL's Chris Lovingood explains, this can be a struggle for the people serving these families. The group Benchmarks is an alliance of agencies from all across the state that provide these services. The president of that alliance says these families need help, but providing it, it's challenging. One of the biggest issues we've had is just being able to get in contact with them. There's no cell service. Just think, your job is connecting child welfare, adult and family resources to the people who need it. But a natural disaster, Helene, is preventing that or even just making sure they're okay. Do they have power? Do they have water? Do they have food? Karen McLeod says as some cell service returns and thanks to Starlink, the different agencies with benchmarks can finally connect with the people they serve. Found out that they were running out of food. They were running out of um, water. Um, they were... Um, using buckets to go to water sources like streams to use to be able to flush toilets. Um, but literally, they were completely running out of supplies. Providing mental help, child welfare, substance use, and intellectual developmental disability services, that is the core of what Benchmark's agencies do. But there's another problem with trying to accomplish that mission. Because there's no phones and uh, cell service and because the roads are so bad, finding the families has been a major issue. But on top of that, for our agencies, they're trying to find their staff. Hundreds of people who help hundreds more that can't be reached. Are they trapped? Are they missing? Are they even alive? For benchmarks not knowing, that's a problem. Literally, we just can't check on them right now. Karen McLeod says right now, one of the most important things that you can do is donate to these organizations. In fact, right now, you can call to donate today with WREL Cares. The number is 919-595-5005. You can do this all day also on WREL.com. And together, we can try to provide some resources to some families in need. I'm Chris Lovingood, WREL News.